With an estimated 153 million orphans in the world today, orphanhood certainly isn't anything new. And while it may initially look like we in the West couldn't possibly relate, a closer look proves the opposite to be true. With roughly 70% of all prisoners in the U.S. coming from fatherless homes, approximately 80% of rapists coming from fatherless homes, and 63% of teenage suicides coming from homes with an abusive or absent father, this generation definitely knows the sting of fatherlessness and the pain of an orphan. While I myself have been fortunate enough to have experienced less issues than most, my father has been through so much more and is here today to briefly share his past experiences with fatherlessness and the pain of an orphan. My issue of losing my identity and feeling like an orphan came at an early age of 13 after my parents got divorced and I got separated from my family. It made me feel like I was alone. I had to defend myself. Uh, I felt like I needed to survive and also most importantly as an orphan. The turning point for me is when I, re when I was in church and I heard that uh, the pastor saying that I am not alone. I am a child of God and I belong to Him. The Bible says in Galatians 4, 4 through 7, that Jesus came to this world not only to save us from our sin, but also to redeem what was lost through Adam, which is our identity in, in, in God. So now I know who I am uh, in, in Him. I am a son and I am in the kingdom of God. What I'd like to share with people who are struggling with this issue with identity is not to believe what the world says about you. You are not alone. Created by God, and He is your Father. Trust and believe.